Yo, what's going on everybody? Um, over the weekend, off stream, I played a League of Cabal Coffers. And I ended up going 4-1, losing my 5-0 to Yawgmoth. So I figured I would run it back and just keep testing different cards that I think would be enjoyable to play with. One of which being Turgrid, because I just think it's hilarious. Um, I was playing Graveyard Trespasser in the 4-1. And it kind of sucked, as you might guess, in Modern. So, the list is somewhat similar. I changed the sideboard a little bit, but not that I've made a video with that. So, let's see how this goes. Wow, I've never seen it just black screen like that. Um, one thing that the version I was playing earlier didn't have was the Voidwalkers in the sideboard. I think they were like Inquisitions. And I don't know, I kind of think you need like a ley line type effect. Because like the Yogg matchup did not feel close, right? I don't have Pithing Needle. I had no um, graveyard interaction really, except for like the relics, but that wasn't cutting it. I just want to like turn stuff off like that. Um, what's going on ocean yeah tr trying to trying to get back into modern a little bit see if i want to go to uh that 30th event in vegas how's your day dude have you been playing coffers still Always great. Glad to hear it. What up, Corey? How you doing, dude? Apologies if I'm a little low energy today. Work has been draining, to say the least. Ooh, get to be on the play. Wow, this hand is pretty mediocre. But at the same time, I'm on the play. I have things to do on one and two. I'm going to keep it. Corey, we, we just started a game. So can I do that, like, after the match? Oh, no. Thanks. I appreciate it. Um, I might just want to be cycling this thing. Pretty likely they play like a bounce land next turn, right? I think I'm just gonna cycle the relic, not with a form like this. Fucking grazer, man. Yeah, I'm going to cycle this relic. Uh, if I don't draw anything else to do, I think it's just... I field on their turn so I can push like a dryad, I guess. What up, Red Peach? How you doing, buddy? Oh, how sweet. Shucks. Did they... Alright, they got a forest. I think this is going to be like a nightmare matchup. Dude, they're all on this fucking Sakura Tribe Elder Tech, huh? I think I want to... Clear their board. They're likely to sack this. Field of the Dead? Did I say Field of the Dead? If I did, I'm an idiot. Am 
My opponent said, man, I thought you were... <laughs> He said, man, I thought you were mono-red this whole time. That's hilarious. Okay, so I can play Karn. Uh, I wonder if they have Bolt. Wow, they got another forest? What? I just get tightened here? I get fucking wrecked, Brandon. I mean, they get two lands, but they don't have an amulet, right? I think this Steve shit is pretty common now. Well, I have an answer to this, I get. Doesn't feel like a good one. Dude, not hitting a land drop there is crazy. Six cards in hand. Now they have amulet. Double amulet? What? How does that make any sense? That means they opted not to play an amulet, right? Alright, I think it's pretty safe to say I'm... Okay, maybe not... I mean, I'm kind of assuming that they have a Titan also, which, what a crazy hand. Yeah, they're just going to kill me. Dude, I can't believe this. What? How do they just have two amulets in hand? They never wanted to play one? Our best draw for me is what, another... I mean, if their last card's Titan, like, come on. Okay, okay. How the fuck is their hand that much gas? I think I want Voidwalkers in and I want Necromentias. I guess I can take out Relics. That was crazy. Holy fuck. I think I can take out a Kling. I mean, maybe I made a big mistake there. I don't know. Bring in Torok. I want the clock. How is Torok going to be a good clock, though, right? They have our Boreal Grazer. They have, um, is, is Red Peach called it Steve? Like, it's never going to attack through. And I already feel like I'm low on space. 
I mean, if you can convince me why, I just don't imagine it's it's good. Also, isn't it pretty likely they played Vale last summer? So you're saying if I can go turn three Necro, turn four Torok? I mean, I can try it. I just don't really know if I buy it being good. I think I would have to cut this. All right, because I still need to make room for two cards. Maybe I can cut a Maze Mine because I brought in all these twos. Um, if I draw a land right, this is really good. So I think I have to keep... I have two turns to draw a Swamp. I think the origin of Steve comes from Sakura Tribe Elder being short for Stee. Yeah, my friend was actually just teaching me this today. Because it's really weird to me. They kept seven. Gross. Two turns to draw a swamp. And hope they don't have Veil. Vale. <laughs> no, we'd made the jump from parasocial acquaintances to friends. <laughs> yeah, I just... I'm sorry, I made an assumption. Okay. It's looking good for the, the Euro here. I think... I want to just play this Torok, not draw land next turn, and lose the game. All right, I will try my best. An untapped black source, preferably. <laughs> oh, good. An amulet. Land, 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 land. Let's go. Do I play around Veil? Vale? I probably can't afford to, right? Wait, it's not called Amulet Titan, is it? Prime Evil Titan. So they can get a Cultivator Colossus? Probably still just fucked, huh? Yeah, seriously, not just any land. The absolute best case scenario? So they have two packs. I mean, they still get a cultivator, though, and I'm just kind of in big trouble, aren't I? Unless I draw a land. Still in huge trouble. <sighs> this is an enjoyable experience.
I like these decks that just like jerk themselves off. I think it's really fun. A nice little 12 12. <laughs> Do I detect a hint of sarcasm? No. No, 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 no. It's authentic. Sincere opinion. I'm offended you would even consider this sarcasm. How you doing tonight, Snow Schwartz? Dude, I thought you were supposed to get one mana per turn. How come you had a weird work day? What am I thinking of? Hearthstone? I'm clearly just dead, right? Very good. Very good. I was going to draw a land. Oh, really? That sucks to have, um... I would think it sucks to have international coworkers. I don't think I've ever had that in any of my jobs. Thanks, Gumanoob. How you doing, dude? Yeah, I'm very lucky. My friend's girlfriend um, made that icon for me, and I really like it. Oh, how come you're in the States? I can pull up the deck, by the way. So what did we learn from that match? Uh, absolutely nothing. Titan does Titan things. Good game. Oh yeah, Corey, where is this thing? Black Red Sacrifice. Uh, this looks just pretty much like a standard sacrifice list, except you have a fable in the sideboard for some reason when it's like the best card. So I would definitely not play fabled in the sideboard. I would play four in the main deck and do whatever you could to make room for four fabled. There's no way it's stock to play one fable in the main and four in the sideboard or one in the sideboard. Yeah, Fable is just, like, so insane. They were, like, people really enjoy the treasure aspect of Ragavan. So we should find a way to make it on more cards in red. And they were, like, you know, well, if it's a three drop, it might as well do a lot. And be, like, also a win condition on its own. Smooth out your draws, ramp you. But other than that, yeah, the list looks pretty cool. I like how the other day when I beat you with Grease Fangs, you said, why do people like playing decks like that? Which, I mean, I'm not surprised you beat me. What, um... Are you the person that turned to me? Like you just went Stitcher Supplier and hit... Yeah, I mean, you just had like... The perfect lotto on me, right? Yeah. I mean, understandably, right? I literally just like... 
why I say that is because you don't really get to play magic, right? I I really like the back and forth aspect of card games, and that's why I don't like um, just like all in combo decks or cheese like that. I find it kind of boring. That's what I meant by that comment. And I mean, right? You just Stitcher suppliered. Ooh, God. I think I still keep this, though. You Stitcher suppliered into a turn two win. If this guy draws a swamp, I'm gonna, I'm gonna yeah, holler. Or, or sorry, I mean draws a, a mountain. Yeah, but you were playing two mana two threes, and I was like, why would you play two threes when you could attack with giant boats? Um. If they draw the red source, that's fine. I gotta get this down. Storm? I've never played Legacy, so you could be right. And yeah, I agree. I think... I really wish Magic wasn't just like getting so hardcore power crept all the time. I think I will scry. Yeah. I'm not going to do it here, though, because... I kind of want to feel the ruin. But then they have two Ragavans. If they play another land drop, though... No, I, I gotta answer this now. I'm mostly joking. I thought it was a funny moment. Yeah, I mean, it was just like, I've never had that happen. It was like, okay. Game started, I did nothing. Then we went to the next game and I did nothing again. I was like, alright. Anyone else have a good time? Ooh, they got the cat, huh? I think I'm just gonna... I think I can scry again. They have Asmo. Ragavan and two unknown cards. I don't think I want this Thoughtseize. Hmm. Just gonna bust my nut next turn. This is why I think Tome is so slow. You would have two extra cards in hand right now. Yeah, I, I don't think I disagree with you that Tome is very slow. But it's interesting to test at the very least. Another saga, eh? Is this the MTG8 sec? What's up, Jack? Let's just draw again. Nice to file. Yeah, I'm very happy that they added Ragavans, huh? Alright, the Ugin will be great eventually. But, so if I have five, I think it's important to pop this yet again.
I'm just going to get the card advantage. And I can play another tome. I got to remember to scry. Not letting this fucker hit me. You already know how much I hate this card. Yeah, I really want to hit a land drop. Or do I want to hit a Karn drop, huh? How much mana do I have? This will tap for 5 plus 2. I'm just short, but maybe I can just keep this, like... That's kind of hard to get rid of, no? Because couldn't I just... 6... Wow, I get to play Karn too. What a what a fun game. Now they can't use that shit. And they scoops. Let's go. Yeah, Ugin is actually disgusting. This is only my second league ever playing with Ugin, and it's like really, really gross. Alright, they have Cat Oven. So I think I want Voidwalkers. I think I can take out Lilies. I think these Lilianas were a mistake. I think there's like three flex, flex slots in this build. And Liliana isn't it. And I wanted to play with Turgrid because in case that new 5 drop is real, this will kind of feel like it, but... Not really. Yeah, I agree with you. It's just like, who doesn't want... Who doesn't want the opportunity to play with Liliana? That sweet, sweet bitch. Dude, I heard I heard murmurs one time that Spike actually knew of my stream, and that got me really hyped, I'm not gonna lie. Because I watch him pretty much every day. Is this a worm coil matchup? I'm not gonna bring in worm coil. And I think the reason not to bring in Worm Coil is because, like, the Cat Oven thing could be a problem. And I'd rather just have it to tutor for. Right, like, it's never going to be attacking well. Yeah, I think it's preferable to be in the, in the board. You have a perfect hand? Mm, fuck it. <laughs> yeah, who would want a worm or a cat? Okay. I would like to draw a lance. I don't really care about Asmo, so I guess I'll just take the Alpine Moon. What the fuck kind of hand is this? Just cat? Please, Swamp. 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 I was pretty specific in my request. Maybe I should have left them with the Alpine Moon. Oh my fucking god, I hate this card so much. Okay. I think I still just play Dothy. I know they get their treasure, but... Oh wow, this is actually crazy. Fable works with Asmos so well. 
What a great, a well-designed card. They pitch a cat. Dash a monkey. Fuck off with this, dude. Now they have four mana and they'll probably hit like a Karn from me. Hello? Hello? Hello, design team? I just think of what the worst possible scenario is, and that's what I predict. That's the way I play this game. They didn't even want to play their Asmo. How cool is that? Um... I can actually play a Fabled. I think I just attacked the Karn. No, why would, why would it stop that? Cycle Street Wraith, so now they're going to... I mean, I gotta stop this fucking dumbass. I don't care about this Karn, really. No, that's, I mean, that's reasonable. You don't gotta discount yourself. Okay, they called it Urborg? Power Conduit. Their last card is Asmo, no? Dude, not hitting these lands feels really bad. Can I afford to take three more damage? I guess I won't if I play this Fable. Maybe I should have saved that for Saga. This was actually really bad, the more I'm thinking about it, but that's okay. Okay, so this keeps the cat at bay. But they also stop my treasures, huh? I think I do just block this. Whoa, I'm bad. Cool. I mean, I still think I have to block that. I'm going to loot away this relic. They have a spell bomb. Okay. Uh, losing to your own cards. Play 
bit of black leaf cliffs. Well, Klingon has graveyard values. That was pretty sick. I just need to survive, I think. But... I don't think this treasure matters. If they go to bolt me, I can just march the Karn. Wow. They're really going to... What? Just to play this Asmo? Let's go. Wait, my Fables can copy my Dothy. Oh, I got wrecked. I'm still okay. Power Conduit is just consistently beating me up, huh? I'm playing really clean here. Good, clean, magic. Hmm. Yeah, that's true, but not the way I wanted to, right? Uh, the Blast Zone doesn't kill Asmo because Asmo's, I think, a zero drop. Might as well just juice all of us. How gross is this about to be? Yeah, I think I think I can. <laughs> oh man. Kind of wondering if I should cling to gain life. Because I have like so much value here. They can always bring their cat back. So actually I'm just going to draw. I don't have an herb workout. Yeah, Fable is really, really, really balanced. <laughs> Ooh. That's pretty nice.
They have a land in hand? I should probably read this thoroughly. Remove a counter from a permanent you control. Surrender. Yeah, they had the Blood Crypt in hand. Okay. One on one, not bad. Part of me honestly wants to try a build where I cut Turgrid, both Lilies, and like the Lithoform Blades. And just play Voidwalker's main. Because I actually don't mind the Tomes the more I've played with it. Karn's great. Funny how they got an advantage card from you. Yeah. Why play your own cards? We'll just both play each other's deck. <laughs> yeah. We'll just tech a Blood Crypt. Play some Fables. Don't worry. Black's Day will come. They will print us some more good cards. Part of me wants to play, like, Path of Peril. But you should already be good versus creature decks. Dude, if that Shieldred is real, I'm going to cream myself. Good cards only in rug colors. Amen to that. Sorry if you can... I should stop playing with these cards. I played, I've been telling everybody, I played a flesh and blood event and I'm like so hooked. I'm like, I'm trying to build a deck and start playing locals because that game is very fun. I haven't played a locals in like a year until I played flesh and blood and that was, it was really, really enjoyable. It got the itch. It got me yearning again, if that's the right word. I like to play in hard mode. I just like the idea. I like the concept of what black is supposed to do in magic. I just don't think that they've kept it in line. You know, like literally the expression from Dark Confidant, the greatness at any cost. But I think the cards actually need to be great to have such a high cost not just like mediocre cards for extreme cost I think that's really weird also what's with this three minute queue time I mean seriously like every single thing black gets is like a watered down version of something else like why the hell is lithoform blight Just like shit spreading seas. <laughs> yeah, greatness at no cost, exactly. It feels like red is that way now, too. Like, let's give. <laughs> Fuck off, Jack. That's true, though. Uh, I'm going to keep this for sure. Mulligan to six. Love to see it. Mulligan to five. Okay, now I'm a little more nervous. Yeah, imagine if we had a run in six. Oh, baby. This burn. A mold of five burn opponent. Ragavan. Riftbolt. It is burn. Okay, unlike some people, I actually think it's right to cast your thought seizes because you get to know what you're playing around. And it's one less damage. Like, see, perfect. Uh, just take Lightning Bolt because it's a better card. 
I think we should win this matchup just because I have Maze Vine Tome. And if I draw a single March, like, let's go. I just want to get this close as soon as possible, right? So I'm going to scry my ass off. Rift Bolt. I don't think that there's many threes I'm going to want here, but I might as well leave the option open for Liliana. God. Sometimes I just feel gross. I'm going to pitch the Relic because these cards pitch to the other Life Drain card. They had a fucking Boros Charm. Still kind of low on life, actually. If we lose this, I'm going to be really concerned. I shocked that in. Oh, did I just forget? Fuck, man. No, I don't think I did. Sorry. Being a dumbass again. I'm pretty far away from a worm coil. So for that reason, I think I just get coding... And I think we probably win here. Two cards, two mana. Ooh. All right, I will scry here. Doesn't seem that good. Hmm. I guess... If they want to bolt this, that's fine. Probably discard whatever I draw. Don't think it matters now. I get to hold up push, play land. Yeah, I agree with you. Okay. I 
kind of think I want Void Walkers over Thought Seizes. But maybe that's wrong. The relics kind of suck too, huh? But at least they can trip. It might actually just be better to do this to keep my black count high so I can have bigger marches. Obviously, this is good. I need some ways to win. I'm going to try this. Yeah, I really need to think about what I want those last few slots to be. Because Liliana just sucks. It's so sad. Really? You like Torak here? I mean, I guess it's a blocker. Torak was another card I just kind of slapped in. I don't know how much I really like it. Really, the build I played last night felt great. Uh, we keep this easily. This I need to draw another swamp again, but like... I think we do keep these. It's funny, I took Inquisition out and I was like, you know, how often is Burn played? Well, here's your answer. Constantly. You know, Sanctifier might actually just be too much damage over time. I know it's a little awkward, like with Skullcrack, but... Dude, what a great draw for them. Swamp? Lithoform Blight. That was... I think we just lost because they ripped this. This is also the slowest burn player I've ever played against. Uh, there's no way I'm going to blight over Maze Mind Tome, I think. I'd rather keep the black card in hand and work towards the potential heal here. Lithoform Blight doesn't actually take them off of the color. Like, I get they can cantrip, but I think it's right to Maze Mind Tome. I can also scry to try and make sure this hits me a land. Wow, that's lame. If I keep it, then I know for sure next turn... I can't keep this. They have Skullcrack in hand. I would just die, like... It missed again? Alright, I was just not going to win this. Thought sees the skull crack. They just cast one of these things in response. So I would go... I'm going to be at 8. I would go to 6. They burn me. 
then I go down to three and I can't cast that card. Oh yeah, I should have scried. Okay, I was, I was never winning this in a million years. Brutal. Actually, maybe on the play I'll do this. That was like, what, another seven cards to get a land? I definitely keep this. I think I prefer this play. My opponent said, I'm on a plane, by the way, MTG in the sky. Cool, I said. I mean, Eidolon just gets wrecked by March, right? I kind of feel like I just march the shit out of this. With like Lithoform and um, Turgrid. And then the following turn, I just slam Torok. They have five cards, but I'm back at 23 with three lands. I feel like we're in a great spot. Another Eidolon. Okay. Karn's pretty interesting, but definitely playing this. Wow, they had another idol on. Yeah, they could be. We'll s <laughs> That'd be pretty cool. <laughs> Should I play an idol on two just for the memes?
And I'll see if they block, and then if they do, I'd rather just play another Dothy, right? Or they just concede? <laughs> okay. March is good. I feel like I need to look at more deck lists for this. I don't think, um, what's it called? Maze Mind Tome is by any means like broken, but I think it serves a pretty good purpose. I was looking at this list and I really don't ever want to play Golos. I really hate that Teferi exists. Otherwise I'd be playing Profane Tutor constantly. I like being on less invoked despairs, but since I don't like Golos, I don't know if there's any other good five drops to be playing. I actually kind of prefer my mana base of being less in on finding coffers. Like this isn't Tron. I'll keep this Kahira. hell does that mean blue white control actually if it's blue white control i want to play this relic i think chess guy i'll still play it if they prismatic it frees up my tome Um, I'm just jamming, like, everything. Like, that's a pretty good trade for me, I think. This is another person commenting on my swamps. Okay. I get to resolve Lily. See if that matters at all, probably not. I think it's discard push angle. I wonder if Lily would even be busted if the discard was one sided. You know, it's not like Jace's brainstorm is a two sided brainstorm. Hit a land drop, please. Nope. Ooh, this actually hits. If I draw a land, that'll be pretty good for me, I think. Be 
think this is too slow. I really want to hit a land drop. So I'm going to discard her. I guess in case they play Snapcaster, I don't want to do that at the... Let's go. I didn't want to target Counterspell in case they play Snap. That's kind of a huge blowout. Oh yeah, you're right, you're right. They have the the beast, huh? Okay. Three cards left. They've only drawn one extra. How many counter spells? Man, that's a decision. I mean, they're missing. They're going to put Jace here. I think they should have drawn two as well, but obviously this perfectly insulates them from Invoke Despair. If I'm able to even draw it now, like the land. I just lose the game. Probably should have just clinged. I really fucked up there. Actually, I'm gonna just do this now. I'm gonna double down on my mistake. Hopefully, I can hit a land. Okay, there it is. I mean, they have to hit a counter spell off of an extra five cards. So I think I just lose. But hopefully this gets a lot better after the sideboard. Four cards in hand, electing to not get. To not buy their companion. Okay. Nah, I'm definitely not waiting another turn cycle. Dude, they're drawing two cards minimum per turn. Last turn, they drew three. Even if I cast Invoke, I kill it to Fairy and they still have Jace online. There's like no way, no, no reason in my mind to keep going. Alright, the Turkard might have been too mean, but at the same time, I'm committed now. What do I name with Necromancer? When I play it in these matchups, I just name, like, Counterspell. Um, is like a... Like... I just think of it as, like, a shitty discard spell. Um, that they're kind of forced to deal with because it's like, who wants to lose every single counter spell you have? Because if I can resolve my stuff, I think I win.
But like the first thing I'm thinking is is counterspell, and then I would think you change it up past there. Obviously, this seems like the perfect card to cut, but like fuck, I don't even have the surprise factor anymore. It doesn't have ward like my new five drop I want so badly. Let's hope I hit some lands. Um, I think I should keep this because Urborg makes my mana perfect. Except for when I draw another Urborg. So let's just hope that doesn't happen. I just want to hit lands from like now till the dawn of time. I'm very confused. Okay, I'm not confused. Opponent's a beast. Swamp, swamp. Fuck. Okay, they currently don't have. A planes? Yeah. Am I supposed to just lithoform blight to get the draw? I kind of feel like I am. Two draws towards another swamp. Both give them a white. This actually gives them all their colors. It would blame my Urborg. Ooh, I actually really like that line. Good call. Oh, that's right. That's not how this works. Oh, I fucked up, right? I should have tapped this. But it's okay. That's a good call. I like that line. Yeah, I really fucked up now. Let's go. I think I just want to bait with Lily. And then I get to hold up their counter spell. I want to be able to cling to dust. So that's why I played the Takanuma. Sorry, I didn't finish my sentence. I think I'm going to cling. This coffer sucks, huh?
I feel like it's pretty likely that they have double counter, though. So, like, I doubt I'm supposed to Archmage's Charm here. Worst case scenario, I get to Archmage Charm, draw two. Wow, that just fucking happened, huh? Now I'm kind of curious. I mean, Ugin is so good, no? I think if it lands, I, I'm just in such a great spot. It's fine. I mean, it sucks, but it's fine. Okay, nothing I was doing was ever going to resolve, huh? You have two cards left in hand. <sighs> okay. Three counter spells, two arc charms in the top eighteen. Oh, and now they have field or er, sorry, spreading seas. That's really, really rough. I think I'm going to call Big to Fairy. Man, I... I'm really disappointed that I, uh... They have Solitude. I found a way to lose this, I think. Single, two Jace, two Teferi. I guess the Solitude doesn't matter to me. In response, pitch three. <laughs> I'm shuffling that deck, dude. Electing to Scry. Two cards on bottom. I still have three more Field of Ruins. Oh, opponent, you can suck my balls. You built Brian? Good. Who's Brian? Dude, 
Dude. Talk about a hand. I think I might as well just psych like, max heal here. Okay, they have solitude, they also have a companion. I have nothing. What is their plan here? Their plan is just win? Did I not just take that? <laughs> oh, great. I really fucked up. Does this take four or five cards? I can't remember. Five other cards. Okay. I imagine they play a large quantity of land cards. Maybe they would have an interest in drawing them. I took out my damnations, by the way. Okay, they have a solitude in hand, active planeswalker, two creatures. May I draw a non-land card? This conveniently misses their creatures. Uh, boy, oh boy. <laughs> So even if I answer this, I'm dead. I need to find... I need to find a march. That is not a march. Okay, good game. That was just a few lands in a row. Let's hope we can get this 3 2. I mean, I guess I could have held. I guess I could have held off on playing stuff. But I don't think it's wrong of me to assume I'm going to resolve one spell. Right? Like, if... The, I think they were at, like, top 18 cards. I'm, like, 80% versus blue white with any version of coffers. Nice. Are you trying to rub it in? Or are you just saying... It's a good matchup? What do you think makes it so favorable? You're on main Torak. I realistically don't think... What I was going to say is I don't think I should... 
I should have played that turn too much differently. Right, they, what was I saying? They were, I think a third of their draws were counter spells. While you are paying two mana to draw to? How am I paying two mana to draw to? Oh, in your version, you play like sign and blood or something. Have you been getting a lot of trophies with your list or do you just play locally? What do you... Um, where are you testing this? Oh, this is, this person was in the stream. How cool is that? Let's freaking go. Another, oh my God. This guy says big fan of the stream and then hits me with a Ragavan deck. Oh, oh, opponent. All right, this one I'm going to scry with. If it resolves, maybe they just ripped a spell pierce. No, okay. I want to hit a land. Oh, that's so good. I don't think I can afford to miss a land drop, though. Okay. Okay. I mean, I thought I just clicked no. Please don't mark tied me. I said please. Kind of need to hit like a lily. I could do two, four damage. They have a bolt in hand also. Wow. What was their first hand? Like, consider bolt counter spell. And now on turn four, they have. 7-7 seven, seven plus expressive. I think I'm pretty much losing this game if I can't answer this. So I think I'm just going to castle here. Yeah, I'm still going to castle. This is super aggressive, obviously. Fuck. I 
still didn't hit a fucking land. I think my plan here is going to be to do this for two. They have a bolt. So it insulates me a little bit. March pith pitch both defiles. So that's three. Oh yeah, that's actually a really good line. You're absolutely right. Thank you. That's really that's really smart. Very smart. Lord Michael, yeah, I am. I played a league off stream and went 4 1. I hate this fucking game, though. Deck's pretty fun sometimes. Modern still has my favorite monkey in it. That'll just kill me. They actually just have. Another Merc Tide? Take a fucking chill, dude. What? I'm just a little triggered. How? They have Bolt. I'm too tilted. I gotta surrender. Yikes. I love Mountain Black Text, but I haven't been convinced to pick this up yet. It's pretty fun. It's definitely not the best, but it's enjoyable. I think what's cool about it is there's a lot of different versions you can be playing. Definitely just tilt it off there, though, but, like, man. <sighs> That's tough. I think Relic is good. Gets a lot better in a few months, assuming Watsi doesn't print a whole bunch of BS for the current top decks. Well, that's if that card is real, right? And even then, it still is a 5-drop. I don't know how much better it gets, but hopefully... You don't see how it could be a fake. Okay, well my man is nuts. Yeah, the new children. I mean, it doesn't necessarily look likely that it's fake, but it also doesn't look unlikely if that makes sense. I think I'm actually just going to march this fucker. I mean, I really hope it's not fake. Dude, instant shredding. But I just don't put it past someone on the internet to make a fake card that looks passable. And then I get disappointed. <laughs> yes, I do. I do. Surprising, I know, but I do.
Dude, this isn't this isn't even a rare. How cool. This I could use a companion. Opponent has seven cards in hand. I'm gonna fucking go after this thing with everything I got. Still six cards in hand. Whoa, let's go. They have subtlety here? That Magus would have hurt them more than us? How? We only have one, we have two coffers in play and only one basic. Yeah, but I mean, they have Ragavan, they have DRC, they have all their kill spells. It would turn off my damnation. It would make my march heal me for less. Yeah, I'm sure they already have monkey. Oh, look at this fucking guy. Yeah, I kind of think I'm supposed to crack this and look for uh, Thoughtseize. Yeah, that doesn't look like a thought seize, does it? But it might be okay. Yeah. I think I want Karn. Ragavan, good. Hit him, Thoughtseize. Ooh, not a Thoughtseize? What? What? See, like, these are the situations, though, with this deck where I'm just like, ugh. I kind of think I'm just going to damnation. Hopefully they play another monkey. I'm just not going to play this Karn. They have four cards in hand. Feels great. Arc Charm. Six cards in hand. So they have another counter spell.
Not a big deal, but shoot this fire buff canal. Oh yeah, that's interesting. Luckily they just have counterspell and I don't get to play ever again. Like I'm gonna do this instead of just doing nothing. And then next turn they merc tied me. Okay, not getting merc tided. Maybe I am getting merc tided. They pitched Scalding Tarn. Bolt. Honestly, I think I'm okay with that. Just gonna hold on to this for a minute. Luckily, I'm still at 20. But eventually, they just draw one drop that wins the game. Ugin. Not an Ugin. What's up, young peasy? How you doing, dude? Consider. Oh, they just drew the card, huh? Is this Merc Tide? No, place Steam Vents, okay. Ugin, please. Oh my god. Oh my god. Huh. Okay, well, I still just tick up this Ugin, right? What up, Gold Saber? A Defile. Nice. Okay. Cantrip. Double Consider. Wow, getting to uptick with this again would be crazy. I think there's actually a pretty decent argument for pushing my own token. Right, like, I'll just attack first. Yeah. Just gonna bluff a little bit with this Fielder Rune. Archmage's Charm is terrifying. Okay, don't draw like an unholy heat, please. 
I want to draw what? Like Karn? I mean, they probably hit bolts, I'm guessing, but. Oh, maybe they want to merc type me. No. One card left. They are getting merc tied. Okay, so my mana is unlocked. Oh, they get a new card. Holy fuck. Yeah, I, it doesn't look like they have an answer to this or they would have used it. So I think... Nice, holy fuck. I guess I didn't need to leave this Ugin alive. But I just like the idea of having the discount. Dude, what a sick top deck. Concession? Okay. Crazy. Holy fuck. Whew. Yo, the, the line of pushing the 2-2 two -two to get the def defile was very good. Karn down to get Fiddler's Nib? What's Fiddler's Nib? Yeah, this is for all the marbles. I could bring in Dothies, but I don't know if they're that... I don't think they're that good. Maybe they... They do the... Uh, the counterspell bait well enough. Or I can cut like a tome. I could cut two tomes. We could try this. Sand's not great, but I'm not going to mulligan. Rilla Torts Treat. Gold Saver, what the hell are you on about? Dude, I think I'm going to march this. Fuck Ragavan, man. Oh, my sweet baby Ray's. What? I think Tome is better. It's Spell Pierce versus Kill Spell. And, of course, never mind. I'll go fuck myself. Dude, the no command doesn't work. All right, I'm going to miss a land drop until they get enough mana to counterspell me.
Oh my god, please give me a land, give me a land, give me a land. Oh, okay. Yes, good. Third Karn. Third Karn. Oh my god, I get another chance. <laughs> Don't spell Beerus again. Okay. Ah, uh, that's not good enough. You know I gotta do this. This goes bottom. If they play a fetch land, if they play a fetch land here, they could play Merc Ted, right? But it'd be a little shitter. I think I still want liquid metal coating. Yo, holy shit, Connor. Thank you so much, dude. How was the real first day? This guy's a little butthole, huh? Boring? Amen to that, dude. Work sucks. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I think realistically I just take this still. And now I can get, um, Ballista. Leave up two mana for the Maze Mind Tone. Now, I don't want to strip mine them because there's... Uh, the Ragavan just, like, it, it deeply angers me. Then on their turn, I can turn off that land. Treasures don't work with Karnat. Yeah, that's true. I just despise rag and i think like they can't hit a land and now i have another karn so like <laughs> sorry opponent all right the opponent said ggs fan of the stream Feel bad to take a, a win from them, but 3-2 is not going to make me upset. Also, Warbreaker, welcome to the stream, dude. Thanks for stopping by. GG's. Sorry about that. That really sucks for you. <laughs> There's no other way to put that, huh? That really, really blows. Ooh, 20 play points and some black card I've never seen. At the beginning of the Arf Keep, you may sacrifice something. Oh, look at that sick, that sick upside. I may sacrifice something. If not, I get beat up. Oh, black. Black, 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 black. What are you doing? Yeah, I mean, that was just absolutely brutal. I will say, <laughs> I'm sure since you watch, you know, I just hate rags so much. Seeing three rags... And you not being able to play anything did make me a little happy. Okay, so what do we learn? Turgrid, 
of course, is a shit card. Lithoform Blight Main? I don't know. Any way to play Mono Black Midrange Control on Pioneer? Uh, yeah. There's a few ways, Yellow Cheetos. Uh, I'm not trying to... I'm going to sh shamelessly promote myself, but on my YouTube, I have a bunch of different Mono Black lists. You could also just check the stream decker if you don't want to see the gameplay. We talk about them in the Discord, too. 